Hello, welcome back. Um, today I'm continuing with the sleeper theme, putting my babies into sleepers. And this is one of my tiniest reborns. This is little Ava. This is her lovey. Uh, she's that tiny, I've had to bring my tripod right down. So this is her little duck friend. At the moment, she's wearing this... Um, green knitted cardigan and hat and she's got these little boot or rather huge booties they're way too big for her and a pre-made sleeper but I think I found one that might fit her so we'll change her today and um, I've got to tell you that uh, I think I might have to take well I know I'm going to have to take a break from YouTube because um, we are, like I've said, having new carpet down in the office and two bedrooms upstairs. We've done our bedroom, that was the first one we did. And because the other two rooms are a lot smaller, we're having them done together. So uh, we've had to move all the furniture out of two rooms into one. So it's rammed uh, floor to ceiling. I'm going to bring you up a little bit actually and lean you over. That'll be better. Um, let's have a little hat off and you can see her hair. She's got beautiful hair. This little tiny one has. She's only a little tiny one. And um, I believe Bonnie from the pretty poppets she's got the same um sculpt as this one so this is a proper preemie um baby grow so it's all velcro and she's also got um a preemie uh vest on haven't you little one she's so tiny such a tiny little look at the size of the socks on her and she's got um a cloth nappy on there we go that's got hearts on could have had that for uh valentine's couldn't i yeah she's uh really tiny this one is so like i said um and i've put a lot of my reborns are in a cupboard and there's now loads of furniture piled in front of the cupboard. So this is what I'm going to put her into. This little baby grow. It looks like a Ted Baker one, but it's not. It's by Next. Um, next up to five pounds. So uh, this should fit her. In fact, it'll probably be a little bit big, but there we go. So the other, uh, the rest of my reborns, except for the silicones, are in a wardrobe, which is where they normally live, an antique wardrobe that Darren put lots of shelves in. And I've got 13 dolls in that wardrobe. But again, that has got furniture piled in front of um, the door, so I won't be able to open it. So... When I finish changing this little one, she's going into the wardrobe and then um, we've got to put more furniture in front of it. So I'll only have my silicones left. Um, where are we going to put them yet? I'm not sure. So I might be able to change a couple of my silicones, but if not, I'll have to take a break until the carpet's done and then we've managed to move everything back. So, yeah, this uh, actually fits a lovely. So, we'll have to wait and see. Watch this space. Like I said, I might be able to put a couple of my silicones into baby grows. I've got the bag out with all the baby grows in. Um, but um, I've had enough at the moment of moving furniture. Darren's been at work, so I've been trying to do a lot of it on my own. I even googled, can you believe, how to move a wardrobe by yourself? And in the end, I ended up sliding 
um, cardboard underneath it and then pushing it because we've got all carpets upstairs so it's not like it'll slide across the uh, the wooden floors it's all carpets because in England um, it's not very warm um, so there she is look that's beautiful on her look at my little Ava let me bring her face up and show you her face close up. There we go, look. Oh, she's so cute. And I love this hand. Look at that hand. So sweet. So uh, there we go. And Ava says hello to your baby, Bonnie, at Pretty Poppets. So there we are. So, um... If I can change another one, I definitely will. But if not, I'll be having a break until we've got all the furniture back to the proper rooms once the carpet's done. So uh, I'll let you know what's happening. So thank you for watching. See you all again soon. Bye for now.